Good morning everybody and in if if you're new here, hi, I'm Cassie. So today is the 12th and I said that weird with an F, whatever. Um my hair is not cute right now, but that'll change because it's the 12th, like I said earlier, and that means it's Valentine's. So Valentine's Day this year lies on a Monday and I have school. So, this is basically Valentine's Day weekend, and my friends and I are planning to go to one of their houses, and we're going to celebrate Galentine's, which is just the girly type of Valentine's. Like, it's our take on Valentine's Day, and we're going to cook, we're going to bake, we might watch Euphoria again, I don't know, but we're going to do all those fun things, and before, I'm going to work out, wash my hair, so it's kind of going to be like a whole transformation, and also... The Galentines. Okay guys, so I just moisturized and washed my face. So I put on retinol yesterday just to kind of exfoliate I guess and it also helps with like the bumps on my skin so since I'm working out at home today and not at the gym I need to put on SPF because it is so sunny outside today and I cannot get sun like so I'm putting on this Neutrogena you guys so I'm all dressed I'm in my parents room because they have a literal better mirror than me so this is just the work outfit I'm wearing these Adidas, and just since I'm working out at home, I didn't go too crazy with the fit, but that's what we're doing. Okay guys, so I just finished doing a 30 minute ab workout with this uh, YouTube channel called No Bad Addiction and I love them so much. Like I've been following them since quarantine and I used to do their workouts like almost every day and they mainly focus on like hit workouts which I love because I find them so much harder. Like for me to get pink, I'm kind of, you know, already cooling off, but for me to get pink, it takes a lot. I don't know if that I don't do my workouts correctly, but I was like, you know what? I really want to like sweat a lot today. So they definitely helped me do that. And now I'm just going to have the breakfast that my mom left me. With. Okay, so this is my third try trying to film this intro with them, I guess. But these are my brothers, Adriano and Alessandro. So they're going to be helping me make the crepe batter and be a little more hectic because I'm with these two assistants. So... Okay, you guys, so I just finished putting the flour, eggs, and butter. Okay, so you guys might be wondering, like, why I have that face, but... Basically, my stepdad, his business is kind of like an event planner and he works mostly with like doing big arrangements and flowers for like big companies like Chanel, um, Dior and those high-end stores when they ask arrangements. And this is just so amazing. But that is so crazy. <laughs> later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one all right guys batter is done 
And I am just going to... Wait, oh my god, I thought my camera was going to fall. So one trick that my grandma taught me, I don't know why she told me this, I always forget, but she always tells me to put like a little cover over it, kind of like to let it breathe. Okay, guys, so I am freshly washed, and I feel so clean, shaved, moisturized, and exfoliated. So, I have to do my eyebrows, and I'm just going to finish up studying a couple things while I let my hair get dry so I can use the Revlon brush. So, that's the little update. Also, I'm sure you must have noticed that this side of my face, there's a little volcano here, like... It's so annoying because I know not to touch my face and I don't get like crazy acne and I'm really thankful for my skincare routine and just my skin in general because this is what my face normally looks like but then I get like a little blackhead which you can't see but I know that when I'm like putting on my moisturizer or when I'm doing whatever I see it and I get annoyed so I decided to touch my face and now I have this little red thing and I'm so pale that you can tell like immediately but it's okay concealer will fix that but if you don't know how to touch your face actually don't even do it just let professionals handle it because every time that i like oh and i actually take it out or anything it's just the normal you know little volcano on the side but yeah okay i really have to get ready now so enough <laughs> Okay guys, so I just finished getting ready. I did a very pinky blush um, and some pink in my inner corners with light lip gloss. And let me show you the fit. So this skirt is from Princess Polly. I'm wearing these slides because I know we're just going to be on the couch. And this top, I don't know where it's from. And then I did my hair with the Revlon. But I'm very happy with how everything came out. So now is the part that you guys have been waiting for. Our 2022 Galentine's. Oh, my God. 